East Texas Madness in the month of March at the WAG, the XIV championship Saturday winner in the women's tournament. They go to the nationals in Lubbock on the men's side, Hutchison, Kansas, the hopeful destination. Nobody wants to go to Hutchison unless you're playing basketball. Blends coach Jeff Jenkins looking for the precious win against Lady Cards coach Precious Ivy. Blend faithful from Brenham on hand. Do they bring any ice cream with them? Of course not. Early in the game, the Lady Cars try to keep up with the Bucks. Destiny McDowell, McDowell works around the defense. Bucks three ball, game on point. Skylar Barnes all net. The Bucks had all the answers on defense, but won't stop McDowell. Beats three defenders for her two points inside. Blend strong on the offensive board. Amira Walker hauls it down. The offense works into the shooter. And at the other end, Makaya McAllister bounce pass to LaFadra Green for the score. Trinity Valley down 14 at the half somehow. TV double C, they get back in it. Tied to 63. Kayla Kelly leads the offense and the shooter, or the shot makes it 65-63. Lady Cards, they ain't playing, folks. And then the Lady Cards down the stretch would execute key free throws to take this game and make it their own. The last possession for the Bucks, loose ball, and that's how the Lady Cars drop the Bucks and are crowned Region 14 champs. Let the celebration begin as they punch their ticket for the automatic bid to Lubbock. 67 6 Being resilient and not giving up. These girls are relentless. We've been down before at halftime, so we had practice. And practice is preparation for this right here. And you all also made your free throws down the stretch. We did. Free throws win games. Free throws defense and rebound. It's going to win the championship, as you can see today. One final question. How motivated is this team after today? Hey, the motivation is crazy. These ladies have been working hard all year. And this right here is just one stop of what they've been working hard for, uh, towards. So we got one more stop to make, and it'll be in Lubbock.